Welcome to class number 19, the Old Testament, the book of Leviticus, author, purpose, topics. Leviticus is the third book of the Mosaic Pentateuch, the Torah of the Old Testament and the entire Bible. The name comes from the priestly tribe of Levi. It consists of 27 chapters. The author of Leviticus, as well as the entire Pentateuch, is the holy prophet Moses. His authorship is confirmed by Jesus Christ in the Gospels, as well as by other books of the Bible, the Talmud, and ancient historians Flavius, Philo, Philo, and others also confirm that. The content of the books of Moses is relevant to its time and place. All things are described in detail by a man and four people who lived in the Egyptian desert at that time. The chronological rather than systematic order of presentation of laws also indicates that these books were written gradually. The content of Leviticus reflects life in the camp, which indicates the fact that it was written in the desert. Leviticus is a book for priests, a collection of rules given by God through Moses on Mount Sinai. It sets out the laws on sacrifices, on priesthood, on physical and moral purity, on holiness, on the order of divine services, on holidays, Sabbaths, and jubilee years, years, and the prophecies of Moses about the Jews. There are only two brief narrative episodes in this book, Leviticus chapter 10, verses 1 to 6, and chapter 24, verses 10 to 23. Most of the prescriptions are of a universal nature. A smaller part was given for life in the desert. The purpose of the book is to educate the people of God from the Jews. The idea of holiness runs through all the chapters of the book, the holiness of the priests, the people, the holiness of space and time, like the land of Israel, Sabbath, holidays. A special role is assigned to the sons of Aaron, the priests who offer sacrifices and serve as intermediaries between Israel and God. They are entrusted with the task of instructing Israel, preventing the desecration of the holy place, and purifying the holy place when it does take place. <clears throat> the rituals in the book of Leviticus have a moral meaning. Sacrifice is a sign of love of a person for God. But the main factor is everyday behavior, the attitude to our neighbor, to the alien, to the weak and the needy. Israel has high moral requirements concerning not only actions, but also intentions to love one's neighbor, not to harbor hatred in the heart, etc. The book covers a period of about a month from the construction of the tabernacle to the order of Moses, to uh, the order of God, to Moses to conduct a census on the first day of the second month and of the second year after leaving the land of Egypt. The book of Le Leviticus contains 247 of the 613 commandments of the Jewish religion. Note that the apostles on their 
council abolished the whole law of Moses except for abstinence from things polluted by idols and from sexual immorality and from things strangled and from blood. Acts chapter 15, verse 20. Even the Ten Commandments are interpreted by Christians from the higher level of the New Testament. Thank you for joining us for class number 19, beginning of the book of Leviticus.